Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Robotics Club is after school on Tuesdays and Fridays. See Mr. Rayburn or Ms. Per Perkins for more information. International Club will be having a happy holidays photo booth during all lunches this week. Get your picture taken with Santa. All pictures are a dollar. ESS for Science will only be offered on Thursdays in room E200. And KYA will be collecting scarves, hats, gloves, and other winter clothing items to, no to donate to homeless shelters. There will be a box in each academy, and it will end this Friday. The deadline to join the track and field team will be Monday, December 4th. No exceptions, unless you are part currently participating in swim or dive, wrestling, and basketball. Must have an updated physical on file or on hand. Practice begins at 3.30 on the track. The Elf movie show it has been canceled. Please stay tuned for Mr. Diaz. He's making his list. He's checking it twice. He's going to find out who's naughty or nice. Guys, this is my favorite time of the year. I got little kids at home, and uh, I remember growing up and how excited I used to get around the holidays. But I got to tell you, Make sure you get all your reassessments and all your makeup work because what's going on is teachers are going to have that week of finals. We posted the final schedule on the Internet. We posted it on uh, all of our bulletin boards. That week of finals, teachers are going to be in a time crunch to get everything graded and updated the grade book and put everything in the grade book. So you have to make sure, I need you to make sure you are responsible with your assignments and everything that you got to take care of. And responsibility is, of course, one of our employability rubric indicators. Right now, there's basketball going on, and I know the basketball coaches are using employability to check on their guys. I know that our teachers are updating their grade books constantly to check on eligibility. We're checking eligibility for all athletes, wrestling, all of our athletes. We're checking eligibility on every single week. So make sure that you guys are doing a good job being on time, on task, using appropriate language, appropriate electronics, being respectful and being responsible. That is huge. Guys, we're going to close down the gym in the mornings. Too many people are taking food into the gymnasium, and I've already asked you on multiple occasions when I go over the morning procedures not to take food into the gymnasium. That playing surface is brand new. Those bleachers are high-end, wood grain, expensive bleachers. We can't have food messing them up. We don't allow food during the ball games in the gymnasium. We don't allow food during lunch or breakfast in the gymnasium. So if you don't pay attention, listen, and follow our directives, we're going to change the way that we handle things. We have a f basketball game here Friday night. Last basketball game, we had a very vibrant and excited student section. It pleased me. It really felt like the high school, school spirit type of environment that we're trying to establish at Douglas. But let me be very, very clear. You cheer for your team. You do not disrespect, mock, or belittle the other team. It's okay to say we're better. It's not okay to say you're bad. Make sure that you are treating yourself, your school, with dignity and class consistently across the board. You are your own brand, and you must market and represent your brand in a positive light, in a positive fashion. Teachers, please, at this time, take a second and scan the room for badges. If they don't have their student ID badge visible and on their person, please ask them to go to the social stair. And at that point, Mr. Clement and members of our administrative team will be there to support you in that endeavor. If you have a kid that's not complying or not listening, just dial the front office and we'll be right there to help. But please take attendance, send badge violators to the social stairs. We will enforce Chromebooks badges every single day here at Douglas. I'm Lester D as your principal, and it is an honor and a privilege to serve you in this capacity.